David. It was 5 4 when we came down here last year, 4 4 today. How are you feeling? <laughs> these, these, them sort of games and, 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 and not good for your heart, Will. Um, it's hard to be disappointed. I'm, I'm not. I, I mean, I am a little bit and three of the goals we've conceded, but great fight shown. Four goals scored. Um, uh, not overly ecstatic, not, but not disappointed. So, from the start, Sean Jeffers starts again. Mitchell Vies out. That's an illness thing. Is that right? Yeah, Mitch is ill. Yeah. Um, what was you thinking between behind how you set up today? Obviously, two very similar styles, and that's kind of what creates these very open games. Listen, they're they're, they're a very good side. Let's not make no bones about it. <coughs> um, they're very good, very good, Worthing, on and off the ball. Um, we knew it was going to be a difficult game. You, you, you got to come. You got to be on it mentally, physically, off the ball for a hundred minutes against today's opponents. But then you've then got to be on it mentally and physically on the ball for a hundred minutes. Um, and, and we was in spells, not not the 100 minutes. First 10, 15 minutes, could not have asked for a better start. Then, then we do our conceding. <laughs> to be 3-2 down at half time and the manner of two, two of the goal. I mean, the first goal was lovely football from Worthing from, from one side to the other and, and in behind and across, but to not lay a glove on them. And then the next two goals will... Uh, it's hard to take. It's hard to take. Um, so to go in three-two downs, disappointing. But <clears throat> it wasn't. It wasn't so much off the ball that, that hurt me the first half today. It was us on the ball. You know, if you're going to play in a team that passes it, you you got to want to get on the ball. You got to want to be involved. You got to want to make angles. You got to. You got to be involved in the game. And and and. And when you get it, you got to look after it. You got to have pictures, especially against a team that's going to pressure, because you you ain't got long on the ball. And 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 today, for the second half of that first half, we was found wanting a little bit. So to come out and and, and show the fight we did and get a result in the end, it was um, uh, yeah. Obviously, if he scored late on to draw it level, do you think that's a, the draw is a fair reflection of the game, or do you think one side edged it slightly overall? Listen, if, if you're going to look at the game as a whole, Worthing probably had more of the game. Definitely, definitely had more of the ball. Um, but but we had a lot. We had chances. We had chances today. We 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 hurt them. We hurt them and, and created goal scoring opportunities. But if you if you're going to look at Probably chances and, and, and possession of the ball Worthing were were definitely the team on top today. And then in terms of going forwards, Zane and Michael Clark both involved in the warm up today. You already smile at the thought of Zane being back, is that I am. something right on the horizon? Yeah, I mean he's been joining in, he's had one session Thursday. He he's been out for a long, long time. Well what was it, was it August the fifth, sixth? Uh, yeah, I mean I really want to just put him straight back in but I know that's not the right thing to do as much as we need him as much as we need him a, a, a player that takes the ball in any position can look after it can, can wriggle away from pressure 1v1 creates overloads on its own just a person that wants to play football well, wants to get on the ball has an enthusiasm to play football the tougher it gets the, the harder he works <clears throat> it's a big miss and, and, and he's close and I, I, I am excited to have Zane back and Clarky <laughs> <laughs> nice speech for Clarky <laughs> um, and obviously bigger picture you talk about how good Worthing are as a side um, because of the run do you think it's still really important to take this as a, as a, as a good point off a side it's he will be at the top end it's definitely a positive result well it's definitely listen it's not a defeat for one and it's a point against a, a really good side yes they're not top of the league but <laughs> football's, a, football's a crazy game well they're, they're, they will be there or thereabouts believe me 
and then next weekend back at home against Chelmsford then Dart for the week after and then it's into Christmas against Hemel it's four, that's four tough games is that what you were going to say that's four tough games I was games. going to ask about the squad Listen, in, in general uh, and preparing for it yes we're getting a couple of bodies back but we, we, we're sort of I mean I think that's Nathan out again it's I don't know you just I, I, I don't question you just, I, I don't know are people doing everything they can to be right you know we're a part time club but you've got to have a full time mentality as a player if you're, if you're going to play football to a level put your life and soul into it Put your life and soul into it for the short spell you've got at it. Because it comes and goes quickly and 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 it does. Why not give yourself the best opportunity to be the best you can be? And the squad and the games. They're diff- Listen, there, there's not an easy game at this level. Uh, I think more so this year. I think the league as a whole is... I think the standard, like anything, like anything in life, any industry, the standard gets better year on, year out. Year in, year out. (laughs) And then then just just finally, um, you talked before about you your love for this club and, and your passion for this club and at the end of the game today the fans were cheering your name at the end how how important is that for you and, and how glad you see them sticking with it despite listen, a rough run listen we've had a an unbelievable year last year an unbelievable year last year now should we be doing that every year Will I'm trying my best to get us there believe me there is not a person working harder than me that I I want to win football matches for this football club and 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 last year it was we're on the we're on the gravy train if you like this year's difficult and it takes everybody like I've said to the boys in there it's going to take everybody sticking together you want to win games everybody's got to be pulling in the same direction everybody out on that field everybody in in the dugouts the ones that are not selected the ones that are subs that are going to come on everybody in your squad has to be pulling in the same direction and everybody in the stands makes a difference I can't, I always say it to you I don't, and the fans were superb today throwing away another 2-0 lead you know they didn't stop singing makes a big difference and and yes you, you get the odd one here and there but that's football that's football I'm, I've got big shoulders Will I've been in football a long long time believe me uh, and and as I say uh, there's not a person that don't want a, this club to do better than me this is my 8th year that I've been here 8th, ninth might be I don't know how many 100 games I want to win football matches for this football club. Perfect. Thank you, Nobby.